I say it since I was 30 years old. One day I would like to help the young artists. This has always been my dream. I like to be with, with young people. I want to pass what I have learned and being able to perform with them. Good evening again. Here we go with our masterclass of the Virtuosos Visegrad 4 Plus, which actually is more of a classic musical party, just for fun. Tonight is about playing joyful music, not about competing with each other. Also, we are preparing the contestants for the grand finale, where the super judge will be Maestro Placido Domingo. We have already seen one talented young contestant from each of the five countries and now we will meet another five young musicians. As in the first part, we will continue to have our five fantastic judges coupled with a super judge, Coco König, tonight to give their advice in the performances of the children. So, let's continue our show. Ready, Thomas? Yeah, I'm, I'm ready. <laughs> okay, Virtuosos Visegrad 4 Plus, the future of classical music. My husband and I are musicians, and Edward has a younger brother. I'm very happy that they can enjoy playing music together, even if they play different instruments. My parents met because of music. It connects us all despite different cultures and religions. As the contestant for the finals is... Edward Kolak. This time I picked the third movement of Kongo's violin concerto. He is one of my favorite composers. He is a genius. He was also a film composer. He wrote many film scores and it matches the style of a show like this. On stage, Eduard Kolert from Czech Republic.
That sounded like the soundtrack from Jurassic Park or Star Wars or something like yeah. this. Great music, grand music. And you look like you work in a boys group. <laughs> Did you ever think about becoming a popular guy instead of a classical star? Really, I always wanted to be a classical musician, soloist and conductor. But like lately I thought about maybe also adding acting into it. Mm -hmm. but as a musician, I want to be basically the classical okay, musician so with you some little music. You know you, you like the road you are walking on, yes. which is very good, and you do perfect as far as I understand. So let's see, uh, talking about uh, kind of stage performance, Coco, are you with me? This guy is built for the stage. You're so built for the stage. Were you nervous? No. You were, I could tell that you were not nervous because you had these little breaks, these little moments where you weren't playing and it's almost as if you were just taking a small little break and then you went back onto your violin. So it was really impressive to see how you just went along with, with the entire, with, with the entire um, track that way. And um, you have this certain coolness about you. I, I really like you. Peter? I think uh, you have brilliant technique and you have uh, a, a very good tone as well. I would probably go more extreme to the dynamics even more to make a subito piano, subito forte, like more, more ecstatic, you know, all, all these changes and everything. But I mean, it's really, you are very concentrated. You are very, very, very into the piece. So congratulations. You are a very big talent. Thank you. Thank you. Before Gabriela is going to talk to you in Czech, we have to talk about your languages. This is very interesting. Your mom and you, you speak in Japanese, yes. right? Your mom talks to your dad in French. Yes. And if you talk to your dad, you talk in Czech. Yes. Crazy. The neighbors <laughs> gave up. The neighbors gave up listening, right? So, Gabriela, let's listen to his Czech, whether he's as good as in Czech as he is in violin playing. Yes. He is a genius. Eduard, thank you. I'm really proud of you. First of all, this piece has been an incredibly good choice. Korngold was one of the fathers of film music, and his music matches the style of this show perfectly. It was very impressive, excellent. Your technique is excellent, and your dynamics are incredible. Sometimes you were slightly ahead of the orchestra, but this is not a big thing. Today we saw your smile for a short while and I really liked it, so congratulations. Thank you, thank you. I'm watching you and I will look forward to see you in the final. It was great to play Congo's violin concerto on the stage tonight. This is my favorite violin concerto, and the orchestra was also great. And now here in our backstage, we have our wonderful Christina, this time not with her saxophone, but still with her best friend. Hello. Hello. You're here. I heard you went around Budapest and you saw a lot of beautiful things, but from a very certain point of view. Is that true? The yes. Heard you were on this thing when you go in circles up and down yes okay as you can see christina is a very secretive girl so while she's making her way to the stage we're gonna see her adventures good luck Why my mom and I was walking, we saw the big well, which offers a view of the whole city. So we took a ride on it, we looked around. It was so beautiful because this way we could see the entire city. I really liked it because Budapest is beautiful. The decision was really tough. At first, Lena and I held each other's hands and we were waiting for the name of the winner, Lena or I. Kristina Vasic. I don't know why they decided to pick me, but I was very happy. It felt wonderful. And in that moment, I almost cried. 
I love this piece, but it's more difficult than Caravan. I'm working hard to make it sound as good as I can. It takes a lot of time to perfect it. Watch out, there won't be a problem, focus. Give a hundred percent. The maximum. The maximum. No, I make it thousand. Okay. Or a hundred thousand. On stage, Kristina Vasic from Serbia. Christina, my charm doesn't work. <laughs> Maybe I don't have charm. So we have the lady who speaks in your own language, Serbian, uh, Silvana. Christina, you were fantastic, just like in the open casting in Belgrade. There are a lot of tricky rhythms in this piece, so it must have been difficult playing it with the orchestra. But you did it very well. You look very serious. Don't be afraid to be a bit more relaxed, because you are full of positive energy. You have a beautiful appearance, and you look professional when you are playing. Congratulations. Thank you. You were starting to say something. Go on, give us some words, please. Well, I don't know. Can I touch it? See, this is this is where the ear is missing. <laughs> Maybe you compose a piece for saxophone, the missing ear. Erica, help me. Kiki, Kiki. 
Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki. Kiki.
to move him out of reality to another location besides the hotel. So we took him to a real accordion repair master where he admired old instruments with his mouth wide open. Now you can watch him doing this with your mouth wide open. I don't know, he made me emotional way because he looked a little, you know, to me it's sad. But this guy was just, you know, full of joy and, uh, you know, he's dreaming to have his own instrument, I just... The contestant from Poland going through is... David Siewiecki. When they said my name, I realized that I got a step closer to realizing my dream. To have my own accordion. I'm very happy that I could visit this accordion repair shop. It was great seeing so many accordions in one place. It was truly extraordinary. I'm very happy that I could learn so many things from the instrument repairer. This workshop opened in 1992. That's when I started repairing accordions. You can find anything here if it has something to do with the accordion. I hope David's dream will come true and he'll be able to buy his own accordion. Of course, I've been interested in music since my childhood, especially accordions. I've been playing this instrument for six years now. It feels good to see these years again. On stage, David Siewiecki from Poland.
David. I'm shocked. I just read this is not your own accordion. Your biggest wish is your an own accordion. Is this true? Yes, this is true. My biggest dream is to have my own accordion. This instrument was borrowed from the school. Schwinta Maria Matka This is like this is a Polish future star. Alicia, am I right? Absolutely. I'm convinced that to have your own absolutely instrument is a, is a duty of our country. So I will do everything to, to help you with that. I want to encourage you, really. You, you, you play with such a transparency. You're all the notes. So everything is so clear. It's, it's almost impossible to see that, you know. So it's, it's, you are almost genius, like to play how to play the chromatic scales and you know all this, this, this music and also how you did the register and the colors there. It was really fantastic. I'm a very big fan of you, really. Biggest fan of you. Thank you. See. Thank you. Thank you. So Coco. Yeah, I thought it was a fantastic performance. How do you, at least, how do you say speechless in in Polish? Zanie mówiłam. Zanie mówiłam. You left me. Zanie mówiłam. <laughs> Gabriela. David, last time you made me cry so much, and I understand why. Uh, there is something within you which is so strong, your personality, and uh, you have the best stage present that I've ever seen. Really, it's so enjoyable watching you. You 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 move, you dance with it, with the instruments. I, I love it. Thank you so much. Thank you. I think all performances here are equally precious, and I really did my best. I did everything I could, because to me, it's a great honor to be here. Your talent is almost unworthy, even though you, of course, live in this world. So I am really proud of you. Congratulations to you and your father. He is very proud of you. Good luck for the super final, and I'm sure soon you'll have an accordion of your own. Thank you very much. Thank you. The recorder playing of the Slovakian Oina Maros in the semi-finals was impressive. It also turned out that the 13-year-old girl is passionate about the Baroque age and style. She visited one of the largest and most beautiful Baroque castles, the former home of Queen Zissi in Gödel. When I heard my name, I didn't even understand what was going on. Am I in the next round? Am I eliminated? What am I supposed to do? The musician who will go through to the next round will be... Aina Maros. I never even dared to dream about this. I never thought it would happen. Deep in my heart, I hope that I will win this contest. This beautiful castle is in Godelke. It's called the Grashakovich Castle. And I always return to this place because I go to summer camps here. And I love being here. When I tell someone I play the recorder, everybody thinks of a plastic toy that people may use to play simple melodies. But the recorder has a beautiful sound, especially if you play it well and if it's made of wood. I think Aina is a unique character. She must have received her musicality and talent from above. I'm sure she didn't get it from me. Aina, we'll keep our fingers crossed for you. On stage, Aina Maros from Slovakia. Thank you. 
I want to know. They are famous violinists, they are famous like pianists, like I, I think there may be a young guy who, who would say I'd like to play piano like Lang Lang. Is there a famous recorder artist you're looking up to? Is there someone you want to impress with your playing? No. In fact, there aren't too many well-known recorder players. But there are some, such as the Dutch Lucy Horsch. I really like her. So this is why you develop your own style. You just love this instrument and what you do with it is incredible. Uh, I always like it if you can talk in your own language. Which he speaks your language, Peter. Aina, you were fantastic. You really played very well. It was absolutely beautiful. I think you have a special talent when it comes to playing together with an orchestra. I hope you'll be the first widely known recorder player, or maybe the most famous in the world. I wish you all the best. Thank you very much. We are working, you know, the entertainment business, you know, acting, you learn your lines, you try to be the character, but this is incredible. Incredible. And she is, she is rehearsing like, maybe 10 times more than, than you do or I do. This is so much work. Incredible. incredible. And you made it seem so easy and, and it seemed like such a beautiful, like light performance. It was really aesthetically so pleasing to watch. I had goosebumps the entire time. Congratulations, honestly, it's great. Alicia? Aina, your collaboration with orchestra, your grace, your sound, your passages, there is all, there is absolutely all. And you said that you wanted to show that the recorder is perfectly capable of playing more complicated pieces, and you proved it. Thank you. Thank you. Wave them goodbye, you will see them again. I was really happy when Peter Valentovich told me that I could become the most famous recorder player in the world. We'll see. Bravissimo! I know, it was so beautiful. It was magical. It was like we were in a different place. It was amazing. Are you happy? Yes, I am. Basically, this performance today was a great practice for the super final, where I will play a really difficult piece in front of Placido Domingo. I can't even imagine it yet, and I'm really nervous about it. Ildiko Rozsanic, one of our young Hungarian musicians, dazzled our super judge Gabriel Prokofiev and the whole jury, not only with her competition piece, but also with her improvisation. Ildiko, who also paints pictures with her piano playing, is a fan of sci-fi and she will talk about it now. <laughs> Besides preparing for the competition, it's very important for me to get away from things from time to time and to spend time in my own world, which is why I came to this place, to get inspiration. I love science fiction and fantasy stories and theories, and I have my own ideas about the future too. As a matter of fact, I have my ideas about the present as well, and about the origin of the world. I love writing such stories. I create my own characters, I also draw them and publish them in places where I can get feedback, and I really hope that one day my books will reach a wider audience, and they will become famous. ...position that will go through to the next round. Ildiko Rojani. When the judges said my name, I was a bit surprised, but I was very happy, because at least I had the chance to show off my abilities. I play two pieces that are very different from the previous ones, and I love them very much, so I think I have a lot of fun. I'm getting more and more comfortable, and I think it has a good effect on the way I play. I'm much braver on stage and off stage too, and I'm not so nervous anymore.
On stage, Ildiko Rozonic from Hungary. Hello, hello. If I look at this piece at the sheet music Franz Liszt wrote, I think that guy was crazy. Doesn't it terrify you if you see a piece like this the first time on paper? Of course, the first time is terrifying, but uh, once you dive deeper into it it's, uh, and you learn it, it's uh, okay. And when it's learned, uh, actually, you can pay attention more to the performance itself, not the technical difficulties. Thank you for that advice. The next time I play it, I will think differently about it. Erika, what did you think? I heard this piece played by many fantastic performers, especially Hungarian ones, but you had your own concept about it, which was so different, and I was so happy that you were brave enough to go with it, the way you felt it and the way you imagined it. The kind of diverse personality you have is reflected in the way you play, and, and it's truly unique. I'm totally impressed. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. I have to thank you too. Silvana, if you would be her piano teacher, what would you tell her now? I will tell her that uh, she, she was uh, brilliant. I will only suggest for these uh, uh, dramatic parts to have uh, this forte more intense and the piano maybe deeper in the piano, but those are 
only uh, small things to think about, you're in an excellent way. Thank you. For a professional musician. Coco? I mean, I can just agree. I, I'm so impressed by you. I was watching your hands the entire time. I mean, it's incredible. I know we're not allowed to pick favorites, but I really, really like you. So I just wanted to say thank you so much for letting us listen to, to your beautiful craft. Thank you. Thank you very, very much, Ildiko. It was a big pleasure. <laughs> Saying bye-bye. As for the comments regarding the strength of my forte's, I take this advice, and in the next round, I play stronger, and I'll be much more impressive. I keep in mind that what I'm hearing as I'm sitting at the piano may not be quite as loud as what the judges are hearing in front of the stage. Congratulations! This is absolutely uh, amazing. I, I actually wanted to ask you, not really about music, but about uh, sci-fi films. Uh, you're like, yes. <laughs> yeah, tell me, when did that start, that passion? Well, I have been watching science fiction films since I was a child, obviously. Um, I mean, well, since when I was very small. Mm -hmm. And I was obsessed uh, with Star Wars. And, uh, have you seen all Star Wars? Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, the new ones as well. And I've been creating own Star Wars films and characters. And well, uh, may the force be with you in the super final. You were fantastic and just keep on thriving on stage because you really belong there, really. And now, here comes one of the world's best known and most successful pianist. He was the first Far Eastern artist to be at the forefront of classical music in Europe and the United States thanks to his sensitivity, technical knowledge and expressive power. His name means brilliance of the sky. Ladies and gentlemen, on the Visegrad 4 Plus stage of the Virtuosos, the world famous Lang Lang. Lang Lang is one of the most influential pianists of all times, who is a regular performer at the biggest concert halls on every continent. He started playing the piano at the age of three after watching a cartoon that featured a piece by Franz Liszt. I watched Tom and Jerry cartoon. They were playing the Liszt Hungarian Rhapsody number no. two. In China, some 40 million children began playing the piano because of him. He was appointed by UNICEF as an international goodwill ambassador, as well as a United Nations messenger of peace. I think it's tremendously important for, for kids to, to learn music because this helps them to build discipline, to build creativities, imaginations, and just a skill to communicate with people. Is a devoted promoter of talent scouting so he happily agreed to be a judge in an earlier International Virtuoso show, as well as to perform this year as a guest star here in Virtuoso's Visegrad 4 Plus.
Thank you all so much for all of these wonderful virtuoso performances. We have reached the end of the Visegrad 4 Plus Masterclass episode of the Virtuosos. And here they are on stage, all the contestants for the grand finale. I also prepped something, so this is a Masterclass episode. I'm not going to teach you how to play anything for sure, and I'm not going to teach you how to dance, but I want to have some fun dancing with you. Is that okay? Yeah? <laughs> and this is just like to relax. There's you make nothing me feel else. Like dancing. <laughs> dancing. And Thomas, you too, of course. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I've done no, my no, dancing. No, 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 no. Thomas too, right? Yeah, Thomas too. Okay, come here. Christina, the cool guys, everybody, just have come closer. Martin, Edward, yes, yes. Okay, so we go like this snake. Clap, snake, judges two. <laughs> slide, good, slide, very nice. Step, step, head, head, cross your legs, turn, and pose. Thomas, how are you doing? I was a bit late. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you so much for an amazing episode and can't wait to see you all next week. Yes, this was the Virtuosos Visualgrad 4 Plus Masterclass. The young musicians with help of our jury, thank you very, very much. More information about the show and about the contestants and the jury is on our website and on Facebook as you can see below. Thank you and have a good night. Talents Beyond Borders. Perform among the classical musicians of the future on the stage of Virtuoso's Visegrad 4 Plus. Showcase your classical musical gift to world famous stars. And that your talent can make the world a better place. You are going to go around the world. Muchas gracias, maestro. Every child deserves a chance to prove they are special. Virtuoso's Visegrad 4 Plus. We play the same language. The next season is coming soon.